I'll be as blunt as possible with y'all. So first we got Burma. Uh, shit. When I took Burma, man, it was, it was like a. I honestly didn't feel anything. My first time taking it, I had to like bite off my plug. Uh, like maybe like two or three weeks down the road that's when he ain't have any more penis envies i i was just like fuck it bro i'll just take some burmas real quick when i try them out again i told him that this shit wasn't working like i didn't feel anything so he was just like i don't know maybe a bad batch or something i don't know so uh burma i didn't feel anything my first one the time i did feel anything i felt very good actually uh very good and it just gave me a light feeling. If you ever took penis envy before Burma, I don't know. I'm not gonna say it's the weakest one, but hey, it wasn't really, it wasn't really kicking in for me. And then when it did, it was like it was a light feeling, and it it felt like it wore it off faster than than usual. So, cause usually they last about six hours for sure for me. Uh, some people say four to six and all that. It's six hours for sure. From the time I take it to the time I'm about to go to sleep. It'd be about six, seven hours. <laughs> I'm not even going to lie. And I can't even sleep off of them bitches like the night of because I don't know, man. My mind be everywhere, bro. So, it'd be like, I'd be having to really wait, like, almost nine, ten hours just for me to, like, finally go, okay, it's wore down and I can finally, you know what I'm saying, get some rest. So, that's Burma. Um... Number four, uh, we got Mazda Patek. Uh, I really don't got nothing bad to say about this train at all. Uh, I recommend this train for sure. Certainly for uh, newer people that's taking shrooms. So, Mazda Patek is, or I don't know if I'm saying this shit right. I believe I am, but I don't you know. That's how I've always been saying it. But uh, this train is... It was a little bit stronger than me than Burma. I don't know about y'all, but it was a little bit stronger than me than Burma. And it gave me a very light sensation. Very euphoric, of course. Um, I really don't have any complaints. I really can't say, like, I can't make up <laughs> anything else. Like, that's mostly, I'm going to be letting y'all know, like, how the, how the trip is. Like, the body high and... All that shit. I mean, of course, you're not going to be flying and all that. Like, cubes, I can see patterns from all cubes. Some people say they can. Some It's different for everyone. So, really can't say, oh, you're going to be doing this, you're going to be doing that and all that. Like, no, i just tell you if it's... I'll just tell you the real. I'm just telling you the real, okay? So, um, I don't know why this car is going. Okay, but, uh, yeah, Mazda Patek. So, the body high was very light. Uh, very joyful, I think, because I end up calling my uh plug and thanking him, like, man, thank you, bro. Like, because I had a problem with Mazda Patek too. I don't know if it's just my plug or whatever, but I didn't feel anything from Mazda Patek. But the second time when I bought it, I did feel it and it felt great. The downside though that I had is kind of like the Burma. I mean, I don't mind for the trips to be short, don't get me wrong, guys, don't get me wrong. So you know what I'm saying? Some people do lemon tech anyway, and lemon tech shortens your trip if you instead of like eating it. But anyway, I don't mind that or whatever. It was just I be so into the trips and I be so like I be learning so much and it's like I don't I ain't gonna say I don't want to come out of it, but it's like I wish it can last a little bit longer. You know what I'm saying? Just because I know six hours is a long time, but I'm telling you guys, if you never tried it. It gives you such a feeling. You learn so much about yourself, about other people, about, like, what you really need to do in life. And, I mean, you can even play shit. I hardly play video games off of shrooms, but you can even play video games and just have, man, it's a different experience off of shrooms, bro. I promise you. Like, I almost cried on Apex because I, uh, I was looking at fucking Pathfinder and how he was running and everything, like, the animations on him. And it was just, like... I don't know, bro. I was just about to cry, bro. It was just beautiful. It actually put a smile on my face. I was just smiling so hard, playing the fucking game. Died and just spectating people smiling my ass off because I'm thinking this, you know what I'm saying? So, so fucking, um, just cool, you know what I'm saying? How they put the game together, how, how everything is just flowing in life for real. So, 
Uh, where are we at? Number three, we have uh, Golden Teachers. So, now Golden Teachers, yes, yes, I put them at number three. These are actually very good cubes, very good cubes. Um, nothing bad to say about them at all. Uh, body high is very good. Uh, you get a chill ass body high. Uh, at least I did. It wasn't very intense. Um, shit, visuals are good, man. The mental high is is how you want to trip out. If you can find golden teachers around, uh, I really recommend those. Um, really recommend those guys. Uh, I know a lot of people. Them are kind of like common uh, shrooms. But some people have them, some people don't. Hey, what might be common to me, I stay in Michigan, by the way. What might be common to me is might not, you know what I'm saying, be common to you guys. Or what's common to you guys might not be common to me. So works both ways. So now we have uh, number, what, what number we're on now? Fucking uh, two, if I'm not mistaken. And um, I want to do uh, Pink Buffalo. Now, if y'all never had uh, y'all never had Pink Buffalo, then you guys are fucking missing out. That's all I gotta say. You guys are truly. Truly missing out. Uh, Pink Buffalo, man, is like... Mm, it's one of my favorite strains. I'm not going to say it's my favorite, but it's one of them for sure. Only because... I'm oh, sorry, guys. I'm at work right now. I'm about to head in in a minute. Uh, Pink Buffalo is only one of my favorites because, of like... I don't know how to... How the the um, the trip kicked in for me, bro. It, I'll never forget it. And when it kicked in, it was almost like a like a wave. I don't know if anybody else felt that, but it was almost like a wave, and um, it was just like whoosh. And next thing I know, I'm just cooked because you go from like high to not high, like unnoticeably. I want to say with shrooms, like at first, until you unless you've been taking them for a good amount of times like i have then i know like exactly when they kicked in and all that shit but if you had never really took them you're not really gonna know what to expect and how they're gonna kick in so pink buffalo that's a must that's a must guys so next um i think this is the last one on our list uh we got penis envy Damn this damn this shit is 10 minutes long. I didn't even know. Make it short, guys. So we got penis envy. Uh penis envy, man, is like one of the most powerful cubes. And I wanted to mention this with cubes. All cubes kind of got their own like distinct feel and taste. So I can't really say like each one tastes like which one tastes better than the other one, which one, you know what I'm saying? Like it, they all kind of got their same feel, but different feel at the same time. You know what I'm saying? That's what make them unique. But, and this is just for the cube species. We're not talking about any panthers or no, 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 none of that shit, bro. We just talking about cubes right now. Cubensis. So, Penis Ivy is actually one of those, like, strongest cubes. And, um, I think it's actually the strongest right now, for real, for real. And... Man, that, that thing, the body intense is very intense. Um, body high, I'm sorry. The body high is very intense. Um, your legs, man, you go going to feel very heavy off of them bitches. I can tell you that. Um, still, still a hell of a trip, man. I always recommend uh, penis envies. Can't go wrong with them, for real. But, yeah, it's, it's going to be a hell of a trip. Um shit it's nothing really more i can say i mean tastes like shrooms feel like strong ass cubes like if you ever took a cube before and you take a penis envy you're just gonna be like whoa and then you want a dosage like 
you got a dosage different from other shrooms like because it's more potent so a 1.5 a boot a pink buffalo might not be well it's not for sure not going to be the same as a 1.5 penis envy that's just the way the potency and shit goes but that depends if your plug has a bad batch it all depends how it grows it so that's that and then i'm gonna add one more for you guys um just a bonus one mckinney's mckinney's guys uh these fucking shrooms are fucking hitting man they're up there with penis envies i'll say it just don't give me like a heavy feeling i promise you but the the fucking mental high is there uh the body high is most definitely there just not as like you just don't feel as heavy um shit that's really that's really it for really um the mental high that's really what shrooms is about like at least cubes and the mental high is there. Is there? You feel very good off of them bitches, and you will have a blast. Like I literally thought I was in the fucking movies, dude. Like when I was when I first took them bitches, I didn't know what to expect. Cause I'm growing McKinney's right now. They're on my channel too. Uh, I put a link in the description or something, maybe. Um, but you can find it on my channel. I'm growing McKinney's, and the first time I took them. Cause I just wanted to make sure that they was like potent and everything before I started. You know what I'm saying? Really collecting them. Man, them things are fucking hitting, dude. Them things are hitting, and I couldn't actually believe how strong they was. Cause people was like talking down, and all I hear is about is penis envy, penis envy, like the strongest, and penis envy this, penis envy that. But if you guys don't got penis envies around, you got some McKinney's. Yeah. Things are close to it for sure. So I appreciate you guys for watching. I do got to head into work now. So I'll see you later. Peace.